and welcome to Final Fantasy IV Free Enterprise. So I did my best with Super Mario RPG. Couldn't manage it, but I pretty much full cleared everything as best I could. And now, I'm giving Free Enterprise a shot. Now, there doesn't seem to be any wacky flags or anything weird about this one, but I'm starting with Yang and Cecil. Now, Cecil is Dark Knight, not good, not great, but I can at least do the thing, which is good. And um, in each game, you can change objectives, you can do all sorts of stuff, but as long as I get the crystal at the bottom, then I can face Zeromas. Or who I assume will be Soromas. But right now I have the Darkness Crystal. So I could go to the moon and get things right away. But, uh, yeah, no. Yeah, let's not do that. Because Free Enterprise works in an interesting way. In that I need to get equipment. And items. So I don't need you. You start with the Enterprise right off the bat, and then you have to acquire all manner of other stuff. It's got cabins, good. Bacchus wines are good. Good, you can access those. Um, power staff could be good if I get Rosa or Rydia or Palamporum, but we'll see. But the main thing right here is seeing what we have. This seed reminds me of Rydia. I want it. I want Rydia now, and it sure seems like the game wants me to get it now, but we'll see. We'll wait on that. Yang and Cecil are decent starters. Um, not the best, but not the worst, because Cecil can turn into a paladin, and he's an endgame party member. Yang and Sid, specifically, are going to have shit tons of HP, so they could be viable late. So let, let that be forewarned. Silence Rod... Could be okay. I believe this has stats in it. No. A, a different version of Free Enterprise does, though. But I, I have it pretty much in my head which items are going to be useful or not. This is kind of following... This looks like it's following the old school Final Fantasy look. And it is the... Final Fantasy 2 setup, so. Right, so we need to go around here. I'm looking for treasures here. So let's go. Nope, guess not. Dang it, there's treasures back over there. How do I get to them? How do I get over there? Because you need the door to open that, and you need... Hmm... Interesting. I sure hope nothing over there is important, but there are no key items, so live and learn. Anyway, I'm going to save. Really dealing with this part is going to be, can I deal with bosses? And all bosses are randomized. Well, characters are randomized, and their locations are randomized, so here's hoping. Does this look like Fubul Gauntlet or Water Hag? Alright, it's Water Hag. Not good. Ah, okay, it's free bosses. So that means that I only have to hit him a couple of times. Yang's already gotten hurt, which is not good, but... Water Hag's not... Let it be known, Water Hag in a different spot would hurt a lot more. Okay. So we got through Water Hag, but we are hurt. Levels are good, but I need better party members. Oh, not good. Oh, ooh, this is... Ooh. All right, well, looks like we're not getting Rydia for a while. We're not getting Rydia for a long while. 
Well, this is live and learn, I suppose. This is why I saved. So I don't have to do the intro over again. Okay. Well, that sucks. But there's nothing I can do. So let's keep moving. Since there are free or free characters, I could do. Well, that's Dragon Mist, that's not it. I could do Waterfall. So there's Rydia's hometown. That you need the package for. There's Kaipo. I can see. And I believe I have. Yeah, it counters off. So we're good there. Manual auto. But yes, the main goal right here is get good characters, good equipment, and go. There's a kind of tiering system as to which characters are the better ones. So, it, it, every character's viable, but there's differences. And there's Sid, so. Or no, Edge, excuse me. Uh, Sid would have the goggles. Edge is doable. Not as big a fan of Edge, but he's, he's damage dealer. So, don't look a gift horse in the mouth. Personally, I would rather have a different character, but we're in Artemis, so that def Ooh, Artemis is good. Yeah, okay. So that certainly makes Rosa better if I can get her. There's, I think there's also multiples. So you can have like three or four Cecils, you can have five or ten Sids, you know. You know. I can dismiss them. There's no permadeath, so I'm going fairly basic here. I'm going to hate myself for not getting whatever was in that those chests back in Baron, but right now, I'm just searching. Pretty basic. I want those, but I don't want to spend money on those. Don't want to deal with the dancing. And there's no encounters, thank god, so. Alright. So I could go through the waterfall. I'm here for the character first. Ah, Forum. Cool. Well, that certainly makes the Artemis arrows work out better. So, White Mage, boom. And, um, that is very useful. Power staff for silence, let's see, 56 or 30. Shit, alright. Okay. Well, let's give her this already. Aha! Okay, select. Okay, good info. Good info. Bring to Mysidia to get the big whale. Like, if I wanted to get a character from the moon, I could do that. Um. White Spear, so that's good for Kane. But yeah, as we saw, it's pretty much a good idea to just get characters now and start getting items and hoping and praying. These three are pretty solid additions. Once Cecil gets some... Um, Once Cecil turns into a white knight, a uh, uh, paladin, it's going to be pretty damn good. Um, let me go here, get some treasures. Well, you're, uh, you're gone. Plop. Alright, what do you got here? Got anything good? Rune axe. Yeah, uh, Dark Knight Cecil is very nerfed. Rune Axe, very strong. So two-handed damage. Drain Spear, could be fodder. Because, uh, again, they're, they're possible for multiple canes, too, so... Uh. Alright, so... All right. White's better, but there could be multiples of canes. That would be good. Silver armor, I probably can't use. No! I need Cecil to turn into a paladin post-haste. 
Money. Getting money, but I don't care. Odin! I want... Okay. I definitely want ready now. Odin's, Odin's not perfect, but it's good. Never... Not useful. Slumber sword. I can start selling things and get Bacchus wines, but I need survivability. Right now, Porum is the best character I've got in terms of survivability. And Gaia gear is not even all that great. It's okay. As far as I'm sure. Yeah, 35. Yeah, not bad, but... Grimoire. That is... Random Summon. So, potential for Bahamut. Another Cecil! <laughs> so that means another Paladin. I'm really glad I didn't get rid of all my fun stuff. Okay, as you, as you can see, we're already loaded as far as attackers go. So at this point, it's looking like Yang is the weak link. He's fast, but he's not very uh, defensive. That's the benefit that the higher rank Cecils are going to get. I'll go back to the Antlion Cave eventually. Um, I'm just trying to get characters now. And this opens up the Big Whale, so... This is Big Whale and this is new characters. So, I like Rosa, but I don't really need her now that I've got Porum. What I'm really hoping for is yet another strength-based character. Like, I don't even need a cane at this point, because I've got two Cecils. So, Jesus. Because cane and Cecil are kind of neck and neck. Cane's got jump, but eventually you're not going to bother. You're just going to use, like, Avenger Swords or damage and be done with it. So having two Cecils is good. He can replace a Yang or a Yang easy. So that makes Edge less viable. So I can take, you know, Edward and throw him out. Fusuya would be great early. Fusuya would be great early. But let's see what we get here. Love this song. There's Tella. Uh... And another cane. Well, he'll he'll take Yang's spot. Cause I got better stuff for for him right off. So I will uh, I'll take your equipment. Thank you. I'll sell it. So yes, I have I have I am pretty good. Now I want that Rydia. I want that Rydia now. Um, the cane will certainly do damage. At least you would think he would. I don't know. Oh, there we go. This is where we go. Alright, so we got that. Alright, slumber. Yeah, Cecil can't use spear, so I'll throw away everything else. Leather is not as good. Leather's not as good. Let's put silver. Okay. So let's start selling. We've got we've got parties. We don't have levels, but we got parties. So let's start selling. Alright, this is a pretty good starter party. Here, keep the rune axe, we'll keep the slumber sword, we don't need you, we don't need you. Grimoire could be useful, you could definitely be useful. Alright, I've got an Artemis arrow, er I got Artemis arrows eventually, I could use that for Porum. I could go and buy those. And... But there's a little bit of money. That's for Edge, I don't really want to get Edge now that I have three suitable defensive forwards. Ribbons. All right. <laughs> Five pounds. Yeah, I'm gonna want to get Cecil turned into a paladin away so he can get better equipment. The problem with Dark Knight 
is he's locked into the Dark Knight equipment, which is fairly weak. But get his stuff and now, oh God! Yeah, that 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 really is looking mighty mighty good now. <laughs> that really is looking mighty good right about now. Now I just need to survive against it. Uh, oh, okay then. Oops. There's Fabool, but um. Let's take care of this. Blizzard Spear, stuff to sell. Now. Hourglass 3 could be useful against bosses, especially against ogres in monster boxes. There's Palum. Well, that certainly makes Porum less interesting. Um, sorry Yang, but you have no place here. So, so yeah, uh, already we have our party, because Palum could be u as useful as Rydia. So, as good as Bahamut is, Palum will level up really well. Porum and Palum and Porum are pretty much in the same tier, if not better levels. I mean, they get spells at different spots than Rydia and Rosa do. Rosa's physically stronger, but, I mean... Especially without permadeath, I have less reason to worry, but now I can sell Odin, so that's even better. Because Odin is situational, at best, especially against bosses. But I pretty much have my party already, within 10 minutes, 15 minutes. So... I am A-OK -okay with this plan. I just need good bosses. That is possibly problematic. Oh, it's, that's very problematic. But it's better to fight him here than anywhere else, I guess. Okay, come on. Okay, so... Yeah, Porum and Kane are gonna do some damage. Can they do damage? That's all I want them to do. Alright, this might actually not be so bad. Because they're tied to the HP counts that they have elsewhere. As long as they don't miss. <laughs> and... Again, it's all down to gear. But look, I got my party. I can come back. That's not an, that's not impossible. What would be impossible is something even harder. But yeah, look. just fight a couple bosses, get a couple levels, get some good equipment, and those guys go down quick. And with two Cecils turning into paladins, that's tremendous early. So, let's go to Fabul. Maybe the gauntlet won't be so bad. I could even go to the waterfall. Not, not looking problematic just yet. And again, there's Darkness Crystal. If I'm really desperate, I could go to the moon! Don't really want to go there, because that's really hard, but I could. Yeah, they just need HP. That's... They just need HP and survivability, and look at the past, that is good. That's for later. Okay, 
Sell you. What if I get one the... Yeah, what if I get four in the... 10,000 for Odin seems kind of... Seems kind of low. Should have gotten more. Oh well. Get money, and eventually I'll get Artemis bow. So, um, yeah, she can use the power staff. Can he use the silence? We know he cannot. So, it's another thing I can sell is the power staff. So, yeah, let's just sell that. Again, not great, but not bad. I'm trying to save as much space as I can for equipment. So, 21 right there. I've got quite a bit of time. Alright, what do you got? Of... If I want to go absolutely apeshit, this is what I want. Imagine... Imagine three Avenger swords in the front row just chucking damage. 150,000. Well, I have I have my dream here. Um 3 22. Is that better one I've got? Yeah, it's better. So, let's buy you. Huge amount, but it helps. And sell you. Boom. Okay, we have our weapons of damage. <laughs> I like going with weapons of damage. All right, Avenger swords, pronto. If I can find them, if I can get adamant armors. That's it's even better. Can I handle the gauntlet? Because <clears throat> you got to beat some bosses. There's potential to beat bosses. There's just no way around it. You have to beat bosses to get anywhere in this game, so... Or that could happen! I mean, I can't use it, but I know people who can! Big bomb! Okay, Lilith Rod for... poem. Oh, certainly better than one I've got. Way better than one I've got. Backfires against that dead. Don't care! He's never gonna attack normally. Alright, so you talk to Stella later for a couple of things, for a couple of potential key items, but it's, it's not bad. It's, it's not bad. It's starting to make good. It's starting to get, where, get somewhere. And another Lilith Rod. Okay. Cool. And sell that and make more money towards my Avenger Sword purchases. Okay, things are slowly coming together. I've got my party. I just need their equipment to match up to their stuff. Big Bomb could be good. 4,000. And a rod. Keep this, like, Slumber Sword. No. Sell you because I've got two sea souls and they can do this. Right, Forty-eight thousand making money. And heck, now that um, Palum can do some damage, what spells do they have anyway? Not a lot. They got venom and then. Lightning one. That's uh not good. Might have to go to Antline Cave quick. Antline Cave and Waterfall. But I know Elements has been taken off the board in an early spot, so that's 
That's promising. Can I take somebody? Well, Dragon Lunar too. Uh, Dragon Lunar is where Rydia was. But I'm less inclined to deal with Rydia. Dark Imps. Could be okay. Could be bad. Uh, kind of fast. How many P do you have? You gotta hit those. Okay. Just don't hit Palom, we're fine. Yeah, keep hitting Cecil, I don't care. Because we need levels and stats, bro. Okay, Silence, don't care. These guys are gonna be red caps, they're gonna attack me. Good, miss, keep going, keep missing. God, the Cecils are letting us down, and it's not helping, the Quorum is missing. Oh, sweet miss. Stop missing from the back row. You don't have the spell set to be kicking ass yet. And... Okay. And I don't have life, so he's going to... He's going to miss out. Son of a bitch. Beat him. Oh man. Those are levels we could have used. <laughs> yeah, and there's life one and cure two. Oh shit. Look, I got I got something. Okay. The spoon! Alright, I don't have edge. So I can sell it, potentially, for good money. Alright, unfortunately, Palum has no levels. So he does not get the fun that everybody else does. But now I have Spoon! And I can sell for good money. I hope. Make an Avenger Sword purchase, make Kane practically just murdering fools left and right. I really gotta make sure these sell for way more. Holy shit, that is that is not good. Next time I do this seed, I'm making them worth a shit ton more money. And yes, you can equip you can equip the spoon on Edward if you want to make him less shit. Um As you can plainly see, I don't care. But yes, next time I, um I'm going to make these sell for way more. Live and learn. I was kind of hoping I could sell that for a lot more money, but hey, getting levels. Let's try to do like one more dungeon. We can go back and deal with that. There's a couple more, a couple more shops in the area. Five, thank you. A dragoon helmet, thank you. All right, Kane is getting decked out in good stuff. The heck? Whoop, whoop. Flame rod, uh. Good? Not really. I could potentially throw it or break it, maybe, if I'm desperate. Elixirs are fine.
got better. Yeah. I got better. Alright, power. Okay, it's not bad. Wizard, but power is better. More cast. More samurai armor. Damn impressive. And then there's diamond armor. Look at that now. He's got silver. He's got dragoon hands, so he doesn't need that. So do I spend my money? 13 and 4. So, Kane is definitely your linchpin right now. Man, I need those Cecils in a big fucking hurry. Alright. Can't do anything over there yet. That's Mithril. That's an Agard. Excuse me. I'm even less inclined to going into the moon now that there's no, there's no, and there's like one shop. We got sirens, good, cure twos and a pinch. The light sword. It's not terrible, but not great. I think I just equipped those outright. <laughs> There's no way I'm gonna get that kind of money. <laughs> oh, but this is not bad. That's not bad. <laughs> Just selling Adam and Armors. Yes, if I wanted to, I could potentially deck out every single person in Adam and Armor and make them unkillable. And the seed would be baby game. But, uh,. Nope. Nope. Out of way. Out of way! <sighs> well... Fuck. Gaia, um... Can, can Palin equip it? He can. Alright. I'm getting stuff. Slowly but surely, I'm getting stuff, and if I want more stuff, the best place to go is Antlion Cave. Good stuff on short notice, Antlion Cave. <sighs> Alright, levels wise, not going great. But hey, this is the last dungeon I'll check for now. Maybe I beat it, maybe I don't, but... Crystal Sword. Oh my god, dude. And he can't equip it, but Cecil sure as hell can. Well, I sure don't need this guy anymore. I've got Excalibur and Crystal Sword. Two Cecils is becoming a very good idea. If I could just kill things. Fire... It's not as good, but it's good for Cecil, if I can fucking thing. Ow. There's an exit spell. Might need it. Dragoon Hand. Takes out my, takes out my strength, but... Gives me way more defense. Thank you! Use strength. No, I cannot. Damn it! These Cecils are terrible. I need to kill the elements now. And whatever else is there. Samurai shield. This is looking very good. Kane is looking like a killer. Defense sword. 
also good. And he can equip it. And Vital... Ooh. Ooh, man. I mean, strong against spirits and flying foes, and a little bit more strength, but... Man, Vitality plus 15? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. I like that. And I can sell light. I can sell spears now. Anything other than an Avenger Sword, I'm probably not going to find much better than what I just found. Life Staff. Okay. Eh. I mean... Will plus 10, will plus 15, it's... it's better. Can you equip Silence Rod? No! Of course you fucking... Damn it. But yeah, of the two, I would take a higher will... the higher willpower. At least I think that's what that's called. Um... Hourglass 2, pretty good. Heal Potion, not as good. I love not having to deal with random encounters here. Nothing here. So let's go up and save. Kane is looking really good right now. I mean, the only real thing that it could improve is getting adamant, but... I can't get adamant right now. In fact, I can't even use half the shit I'm getting. And these are kind of crap anyway. Is it better than... Yeah, better. Not the stats he's looking for, but... Could help. Alright. Alright, can I beat this boss? With what Kane's got right now, can I do what I need to do? Just go down. Okay. Mom bomb! Probably doable. Explosion's going to suck, but... Alright, yeah, everybody can finally do damage now. Except for Palum, who keeps missing! That's enough. You can stop missing now anytime. levels here. Alright. Cool. And Palum gets the levels he was missing. Not much, but Ice 2! Could be good. La Luca Key! Nice. Means I gotta do Sealed Cave, but... Alright, let's get out of here. I'll get out of here and save. 
I'll save my exit for something a little more intense, like like Lunar Subterranean or something like that. But yeah, good first episode. Made some decent progress, got some good stuff for Kane at least. And everybody else is viable, but at least I got my full party. Okay, maybe I'll maybe I'll try the ordeal again. So I'll park over there. over here. Boop, boop. Alright. But between Artemis and Avenger and Adamant's shops are good. I just don't have the money to get them. But hey. I might sell them. Okay. So let's sell... Sell some of the other stuff. It's a crystal and crystal and Excalibur, so you are expendable. Fire, I might need, I might need this, I don't need that. God damn it, suit. Good for me. I have made headway. So, I'm making good progress into Final Fantasy IV Randomized, Final Fantasy IV Free Enterprise, and I've got my party set up. Now we just need stats. And what we also need is those Cecils to become what they're meant to be. And when that happens, the world is our oyster. So I'll see you next time.